Yeah, I'm Ainsley Jones, super flex, rag I'm off in it, up in the place, yo. I, I was born here, but I'm Jamaica. At the moment, I'm excited about everything at the moment, you know. I'm just vibes up, you know. I got I got tunes on the radio, and I'm gonna be doing a video with Moby. They sent the track to me. I managed to drop a verse on that because I was expecting him to chop it all apart and do you know some crazy you know techno typey vibe you know which you know which is all good but to leave it was even better it's just like you know I thought that was really cool and then change the name of the track to um Alice which which is from my lyrics you know what I'm saying I was like yo that's that's cool <laughs> I like <laughs> I don't listen was more of a process it was um. It was actually the first, first me and my main producer Paul, big up Paul, started working on, and that that was a freestyle as well. I mean, he came with this beat, I dropped a freestyle basically, you know what I'm saying, and the hook came from that. You know, it's basically just me saying I I don't listen, I don't, you know, I don't really wanna business what they saying, and I ain't trying to conform to what they doing, and blah blah blah, and you know, I ain't listening, you know, so I'm just gonna do me. Red is about, about enough things going on. Red red basically is about yard, Jamaica, you know, and, and things going on in Jamaica is such a nice place, but it's, it's so much going on. But they're not related everywhere, you get what I'm saying? London going on the same way, you get what I'm saying? So, you know, in my lyrics I say, you know, not just Jamaica, everywhere I'm going crazy, you know? So that's basically that was about. That was a, a beat from a guy, Ben Ash. I hooked him up on MySpace, my man sent me the beat. And within the day, the tune was done. The beat was hardcore, so I just, I was just loving it, star. So I just, it was just done, man. It was just raw itself, you know. You sitting there writing four bars and trying to make them match each other. That's a different thing. But if you're freestyling, you, you lacing a flow. It's, you know, from start to finish, it's, it's something. So with that, you get, you, you kind of get more shapes and shit, you know. Me and Manny just got a great vibe with each other, you know. It's just like. Sometimes when we're on the mic on the stage, you have to know when to, all right, the tune's drop, you know, like, shut up, come here, and we'll be there, yeah, you cool, yeah, I'm cool, and it's all like that shit, so me and him just got a wicked vibe. Ready for next one? Water, water, water. Let me get a drink of water. I feel like I'm in the desert. <laughs> yeah. Water, water, water. Let me get a drink of water. Ready again? You could go ahead. My stepdad, he was really into that shit, he was a bass player, and he used to love his, um, George Clinton and Bootsy Collins and all of that shit. So he just be playing that shit 24/7. So yeah, I went, I went to, to to a George Clinton concert. I think it was Brixton Academy when I was like, I don't know, like nine or some shit. We flew over and went to that shit. I don't even remember, but dude came in a fucking spaceship and everything. Yo, shit was crazy, you know. Probably one of the one of the first brothers that just really start like him, Snoop Dogg. And then he sampled like almost the whole of that parliament shit. So, you get what I'm saying? It just bounces along, you get what I'm saying? And you're like, where's that come from? You always want to go back and find out where that shit came from. Yeah, man, I'm, I'm loving the artwork. Because for me, I'm an artist, you know? And it's the hardest thing to design shit for myself. You know, I tried and it's just like, boy, but then, you know, you analyze your own shit so much, you get what I'm saying? And for me, it's real, it's, it's real up my street, you get what I'm saying? Like, my mom called me, she was like, that's great. She thought I did it. It's got personality, it's got, you know, it's got my vibe to it, you know? So it's really cool, and then the, the, um, the sleeve just looks nuts. For me, I like lots of different music, and whatever sounds good, sounds good. I rate Dizzy, yo. Dizzy, Kano, Massive Attack, Chemical Brothers. And I saw them in concert, and um, they like the light show. Ugh, just mean, just mean, mean, mean. There's this guy, what's his name? Dirty Dukes. That brother is sick. You see me on TV, dude. You try to sell DVDs while I'm on TV. Man will come back with a DVD of Hazy Jones and sell it to me. Crazy, man. Man. Uh. <laughs>